doing all the stars. Yes, he's like the Middle East version of Taylor Swift. We're here right now, Maidan. Yeah, you got a big show tonight, Priyanka Chopra, ladies and gentlemen. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. I'm very excited to be on Virgin Radio. That's cool. That's cool. You've been on Virgin Radio before. Of course, I have. Well, um, welcome back to Dubai. Now you see you got a big show. This, I mean, what's going on? What can you can you give it's us? It's complete chaos because we have a film on release, which is called Dil Dharakne Do on June 5th, and I'm performing tonight. And I landed in just at four in the morning, and I rehearsed till about 8:30, and now. Um, we've had this press conference all afternoon, and I have to go and do a technical before they open the gates, and then go and do red carpet, and then go and get ready for my performance, then perform, and of course, then after that, um, take my entire team out to uh, enjoy Dubai. So and fly to Ahmedabad tomorrow morning. So yeah, it's pretty crazy. Is this life? Is this just life for you? Actually, it is. When do you um, get time off? What do you need time off for? So you're enjoying, the, like you enjoy this, like it's work for you, but you enjoy it. Of course, I love what I do. I mean, it's exhausting physically, but uh, my mind takes over. Mind over matter, mind over matter, mind over matter. <laughs> now, something huge that happened for you, which I'm so excited for, is Quantico. Yeah. It's premiering in the States uh, this fall. Let, tell us about Quantico. Um, I'm really nervous about it, honestly. Um, I'm excited. I think, for me, it's a really great opportunity to um, to push myself as an actor. And at the same time, I think, um, I hope that, you know, the season is successful and a lot of shows get cancelled and, you know, if, 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 it, if they don't do well. But this is an amazing show with um, Mark Gordon, Josh Safran, all of them who've had uh, amazing successes on television. So, fingers crossed, um, we are one of ABC's uh, most looked out for shows so far and I'm, I'm very excited for the support that I've got so far and I'm really happy that the trailer got such an overwhelming response. So, do you feel do you feel pride like doing this? As in, like you're over in America doing the big the big American TV shows. You do you have that sense of like, hey, look what I'm doing? Um, I it makes me nervous because a lot of people keep telling me that you know being a lead in an American show that doesn't ever happen with Indian people. And I think I mean there've been a lot of Indian actors who've paved the way for me to be able to get this kind of opportunity. You know whether it's Anil Sir, whether it's Irfan, whether it's Ash, so many people. Um, so this is a really one time, once in a lifetime opportunity, even as an actor or as a creative person. Um, so I don't know. I've never done TV. I don't know what it'll be like. <laughs> it's okay. like it's like a complete blind um, adventure. It's good to be sometimes put out of your element, though. What you don't yeah. know. So this this could be a really good experience, that's what, right? That's what all my colleagues tell me. Like all my um, co-actors keep telling me it'll be so great to see you perturbed. <laughs> <laughs> There's been a lot of talk just about the TV show, about your accent, like of you doing an American accent. Why is there so much talk about you putting on an American accent? I don't know because people think that I am a sellout and I'm I'm doing it because it's cool. Um, actually, not. I'm doing it because my character requires it. Just like I had an uh, a Marathi accent in Kamine, and I will have a 1700s Peshwai Marathi accent in Bajirao. I'm an actor, and it's my job. Of course. Um, and uh, that doesn't mean in real life I speak like that. It's it's actually really hard to speak <laughs> in an American accent. It took me about three days to practice saying. Um, Alex Parrish, FBI agent, counterterrorism task force. Oh, oh my that was good. That was, that was good. good though. That, that was, was good. so hard. <laughs> counter terrorism. Counter. counter. How do you? How do you don't see, say counter. See, no, we say counter. I say counter. Counter terrorism. Counter. Counter. See, now do it in an Indian accent. Counter. Counter. No. <laughs> see? see, that's the stereotype what? I'm running away from. What do you mean? We don't all speak like. Why am I getting the, the finger? The, the finger. <laughs> I, I, that was me. What do you mean? Counter. Counter. Okay, you say counter. 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 counter, but we counter. say, but we say counter in the state. All right, you counter. do, you do, a, you do Australian for me. Say count, counter, counter. <laughs> well, that's the area. No, that was good. <laughs> that was good. That's good. I'm talk. really good with accents, you actually, are. but I just have to work really hard on them. This, like, I for three days I was just like counter terrorism task force, wow. counter terrorism. Task force. And you're learning the script at the same like, time. Oh, oh yeah, it's hard. it was super hard because you would have my dialect coach say call cut in between um, a take. Just to say, um, I think you said that word wrong. Job, it's a job, it's not job. And I was like, oh my god, job, not. That really got me. Not a job. 
Totally. We have <laughs> yeah. um, totally. we have a couple of questions from, from some listeners here that we just want to make sure that we get touched on as well. Let's okay. hear these pretty. Rima would like to know, when can we expect a full album from you? Oh my God, I know. Even I'm expecting a full album. For me, it's not happened because, you know, I'm, I'm spread out so thin right now, um, especially over the last two years. I started doing this music thing. I have my whole album ready on my laptop. I just haven't had the time to um, go into studio, fix them and, you know, have it ready. But um, because... I, I mean, I had three movies I did last year. This year, I'm finishing Bajira, finished Dil Dhadak Nido, going into Ganga Jal, and now with Quantico being six months away um, so in America, it. it's ridiculous what life is. I, I really am trying to balance India and international. So I have just done um, um, a song in Dil Dhadak Nido for sure, and um, a song with an American DJ and a really cool rapper who I looked up to for as a teenager. So I'm very excited ooh, about ooh, that. I said? can't. Come on. I can't. Because it's said. A, no, it's on his album, so I can't, I can't tell you. Looked up to. I'm excited. Physically looked up to as well? Like, is he a tall no, guy? No, I just loved his music. Okay, we won't, we won't question you too much, okay. but okay, that's it. <laughs> Next question. Nuron would like to know, what's your motivational mantra? That you just wear blinders and keep running. I think, um, you know, when, when you have a life like mine, where every minute is, um, you know, committed to someone, and if I'm even half an hour late, people keep waiting. And uh, that's awful. It feels terrible to do that. So I'm hoping that um, that's one thing. I have to finish this and then go. Um, see, like I said, people I'm keep sorry, waiting and here. promises are broken and it's awful. So, yeah. It's, it's like a family. You guys are like a big family. Yeah. We've worked in three films together now. So, yeah, we, we kind of like know each other. All okay. right. Well, listen, we're going we're to wrap it up before we do. My, um, my dream is to one day be in a Bollywood film. Um, I'm Australian Lebanese, so I don't think the chances are very good at that happening. No, we've had uh, actors that come from a lot of different countries and work as long as, as long as you don't do the Apu accent when you're doing your in Indian <laughs> Hindi. As long as you don't do that, okay. you learn how to um, um, at least fight off five people at the same time. I can do that. And if you can, make sure you dance like no one's watching. Yep. And do well, lots of long monologues with tears in your eyes and lots of hand gesticulation. Oh. And at the same time, <laughs> and at the same time, have enthusiasm for six wow. people. Wow. You got this. I don't think I can do this, but I've got a short <laughs> script that I want to read to you. Is that possible? Do it. Okay. I'm, being, I'm, being, I'm, I'm a brutal judge. You can, I'm is, horrible. Oh. I'll tell you straight out, I'm horrible. <laughs> this is yours. This is taken from Don, your movie itself. He's going to be Bowman Irani in this uh, scene. This is the scene where you are with Don and Bowman Irani comes and tells you to kill Don. I'm very nervous. <laughs> Let's do it. But I'm not good. Okay. Do you remember this? Is it coming back? Is it coming back? <laughs> 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 this is when you've been, you're being told to kill Don. But then you get shot instead. Don two. No, Don one. 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 Damn, I, yeah, well, that means I was yeah, a Don yeah, yeah, one. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm Bowman. Yeah, Clearly not remembering okay. it. All right, you have more lines than me, so I'm yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, Chris, baby. Let's on. do it. This is it. Oh. Iske badle mein kam se kam yaha ki jo aurte hain, unko to chhod do. No, not a chance. Mini, deka hai ki aise situations, Mini. What did I teach you? Aurti, bohut kam at hai. Hey, aga kisi ko azad karna hi hai do. Don. Ko azad karo. Well, at least he knew that word. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don. Don. Is that okay? Um, <laughs> yeah. You know, I, I think that I think you were different and and um, extremely um, enthusiastic and um, yeah. I'm not really great at over. breaking hearts deliberately. It's over. You're <laughs> a you pleasure. You can't even dance to save, the oh, life, come on. save his life. So Listen, oh, so career's over before it started. <laughs> yeah. What do we do? Amazing, <laughs> amazing to have you back in Dubai. Enjoy the night. Thanks for taking out the time to talk to Virgin Radio here on the Chris Fade Show. Ladies and gentlemen, round of applause, please. Prayer Katropa, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you.